Fujifilm X photographer Kevin Mullins is based in the UK. His style is unposed, unobtrusive, subscribing to the unofficial rules of engagement followed by those who truly practice documentary wedding photojournalism. With an unwavering belief that being up close and personal is the best way to make images such as these, the Fujifilm X series of cameras complemented his artistic direction from the outset. I first started using the X series of cameras when the original X100 was released. I saw it at Photokina and realized pretty much straight away that these little rangefinder style cameras were going to be useful for me in the style that I shoot weddings. And really what happened, unintentionally perhaps, but what happened was I kind of started shooting far more, I think, far more emotional pictures. Get, I got into the wedding and shot from the inside out. I often say that shot from the inside out. As soon as Fuji released the X-Pro1 with the interchangeable lens system, I realized then that it was probably the right time for me to ditch the DSLR system completely and move fully to the mirrorless system. You know, that whole melee after the wedding, I'm in there, I'm just one of them, okay? Or try and be one of them, using very this really small equipment, um, often much smaller than guests have got. Being able to use the optical viewfinders and see outside of the frame, the shooting frame, allowed me to really start uh, observing more and seeing things at the weddings that I really wasn't being able to view too much on my DSLR system. It was not a chore to carry all of this stuff with me. It wasn't a chore to worry about it. For the last couple of years, I've been using a combination of the X-T1 and the X-100T uh, as my primary shooting cameras. For me, uh, you know, from a very personal um, perspective, it probably saved me in terms of shooting weddings. I probably wouldn't still be shooting weddings now if I hadn't downsized and moved to something that's enjoyable, much more enjoyable to shoot with. When I first received the X-Pro2, I was delighted to see that you can control the ISO on the top plate. It is a remarkably fast camera and coupled that with the fact that I can control the entire exposure triangle from that top plate, it probably is the perfect camera in the Fuji X series range at the moment. Fujifilm have really listened to us photographers when it comes to the X-Pro2. The hybrid viewfinder in particular is spectacular and really does allow us to get right inside the frame, see the images and really make pictures that matter. Of course, one of the benefits of using an electronic viewfinder is the fact that what you see in the viewfinder is what your picture is going to look like. So this has enabled me to really embrace the JPEGs that the Fujifilm system creates. I prefer to use the classic chrome film simulation when I'm shooting in colour on all of the more recent cameras. And when I'm shooting black and white, I'm shooting with the R filter, the red filter. And it really has made a difference to my workflow. As a professional wedding photographer, when I'm delivering maybe 400 pictures per wedding, shooting in JPEG and having those images created in the camera essentially really makes a huge difference to the time I spend at the computer afterwards. I've really enjoyed using the X-Pro2 over the last couple of months at my weddings. It's great to have a system that's tactile, that allows me to control the entire exposure triangle from the top plate. It's got no noticeable lag and Fuji really do need to be congratulated for retaining the look and feel of the original X-Pro1 that all of us professional photographers really loved. On a very personal level, I really have to thank Fujifilm and the X-Series for really breathing passion back into my photography.